This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It's Atletico Madrid versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, this is magnificent. The atmosphere inside this stadium is electric. Let's just hope the tension doesn't affect the players. It shouldn't do. Just look at the quality down there. You know, Stuart, I think the words fearsome striker fit the bill when we talk about Luis Suarez. What do you expect to see from him here? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out of situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. This is the starting lineup for Atletico. Jan Oblak stands between the posts. Stefan Savic plays with Jose Maria Jimenez in the center of defense. Koke starts alongside Jeffrey Condombia in central midfield. And so to the forwards, Luis Suarez starts alongside Antoine Griezmann. is the team Manchester United will go with. David De Gea starts in goal. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Frankie de Jong in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And they get the ball rolling in the Champions League final we're about to find out who will be crowned club kings of Europe good looking sequence and space to cross it possession given away unfortunately we're really closing him down here Savic. On to De Power. Condogbia. Now De Power. Koke. The ball with Condogbia. Griezmann. Making progress. Now Griezmann. Well, they keep the ball moving. Sends it back. Okay. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Potentially freedom for United on the flank. And a corner kick, the referee's verdict. to pick out a teammate insufficient accuracy as regards the corner Atletico get the free kick decision their way
Ronaldo. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Ronaldo. Can he put them in front? Well, they've solved the problem for now, but let's see. Fine cross into the middle. A very effective clearance. And using his strength to shield the ball. Plenty of options. Not a classic example of how to intercept. From Dogbia. Koke with it. The ball with Kondogbia. Jimenez. On to De Power. Savic. Riesman. Kondogbia. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Frankie de Jong. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Can they nudge in front? Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Well, there you have it. In terms of possession, there's not much in it. It really has been a hard-fought battle so far. One of these teams needs to start taking a risk or two. Suarez. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. Cuts it back. The first half story has been told then here at the Estadio Metropolitano. <music> 45 minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. And he's taken it away. And Dombia with it. Now Suarez. Splendid defending. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, full marks to him for that header, but the goalkeeper did his job. On Dogbia. And he stopped them in their tracks. Well, the keeper's made a good save, but you just sense a goal is coming soon. De Jong. On to Van der Beek. Frankie De Jong. Van der Beek. Here's Ronaldo. Oh, he's given the ball away. Marcos Llorente. Condombia. Suarez. Koke. Now Griezmann. Promising possession, this. Griezmann. On to Koke. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball.
Cristiano Ronaldo. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Bruno Fernandes. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. Koke. On to Suarez. De Powell. Keeping the ball moving. Koke. Sound piece of goalkeeping. And a throw in it's going to be. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. It is an Atletico substitution. Successful intervention, winning the ball back. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Carrasco. Reinildo. Now De Paul. Coque. Carrasco. On to Suarez. Griezmann. Well, they still have designs on the win. Griezmann. Llorente. Terrific block. Cristiano Ronaldo. Running room galore for United. Frankie de Jong Ronaldo and a tidy challenge well the United fans are making so much noise here they believe the winner's coming but it needs a moment of inspiration from one of those players out on the pitch what a finale to this game we've got Suarez well the stoppage time situation one minute here well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. Well, the ball rolling again here. The first period of extra time, and you've got to wonder to what extent fatigue will play a part in this now. It's been an extremely competitive 90 minutes. Rafael Varan. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Carrasco. Marcos Llorente has it. They really look after the ball when they have it. And it's United's turn now. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Cristiano Ronaldo. Christian Eriksen now. In with a chance. And a goal! Just when we wondered if this might finish, nil nil. There it is. They're in front. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish.
Jimenez. Well, there you have it. Atletico have controlled most of the possession, but they aren't doing enough with it. They need to pass it quicker, play forward earlier and show more energy. Otherwise, they won't get back into this one. This could level it. And he thwarted the attack with a masterful tackle. The first period of extra time is over. 15 minutes left. Maybe after that, penalties. We'll see. Well, who is going to come out on top? Let's see if we find out in the second period of extra time. Griezmann. Koke with it. Carrasco. Now De Paul. Koke. And the body in the way. Dumfries. Cristiano Ronaldo. A really sumptuous ball. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. Playing it short. He made it look simple, really. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Griezmann. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. After 120 minutes, they cannot be separated. And so, in this Champions League final, it comes down to a shootout. And they get the ball rolling in the Champions League final. And now it is all about the penalty shootout. And he scores! Oh, he saved it! And straight down the middle. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. Job done from the spot. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Composure is so important under these trying circumstances. And confidently converted. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And just like that, he's come up with the save. A goal now, and his team will prevail. One team jubilant, the other distraught.
Well, what an end into a very good tournament, and I think they fully deserve to win it. Maybe not in this manner, though, but it was great entertainment. It certainly was, and they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment for everyone involved with the club, but for their opponents, it's a case of trying to forget and move on as quickly as possible. Well, I think we should give them some credit too. They played their part in what was an excellent contest. Some of their football was brilliant. Yes, fair play, Stuart. The party in full swing now. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. A trophy lift to top them all for Atletico Madrid, winners of the UEFA Champions League. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these 